when you're widowed young um, and as a parent of young children, absolutely everything changes. I was worried and I was quite scared that obviously James, is, James had the full-time salary coming in and mine was a part-time carer's salary. James died very suddenly. He had a stroke. It was a, it was a bank holiday weekend and, you know, life changed from then. All the things that James and I had felt that we could provide our children with, all of that suddenly seemed to go. I couldn't find the money or the justification to be paying after school clubs and the equipment that the children needed. You don't want your children to feel too different in any way um, and you obviously want to provide the best and I suppose there's also some overcompensation for the fact that you are the only parent and your children have suffered a huge trauma that you had no control over. That money would have helped with day-to-day -day costs for the children, new uniforms, the cost of their education, the cost of school trips. Yes, I would probably pay for more therapy for the children. So this would have been money that James would have paid through his national insurance contributions throughout his working life. He was 41 when he died, he'd worked since he was 18, and I, I wonder what's happened to that money. He was their father in every way. I feel that he's now not being treated as their parent and, and the children aren't allowed his contributions.